All right, so Naki Joe Cards sent in some little breakdown off of 15 cases for the beautiful copy. And these are Australian cases for those of you that are curious. So just a little breakdown of what you're actually seeing here. I'm just confirming more numbers and things uh, that you guys have seen. Man, look at those short prints. So out of 15 cases, your short print numbers are 75 nurses. Like, excuse me, 83 copies of Kitchen. And then uh, Mardell had 86. And then we had 112 of the generator light stage, which, okay, sure. Uh, and then we had uh, Laplacen at 75. And then we only had 34 copies of Almatarion. Let that sink in. Those crazy, those are really crazy numbers. And uh, most of these are going to be available on uh, Nike Joe Collectibles. I'll leave a link down below for those of you. They should be in circulation here in the next hour or so. For those of you that are curious on picking up copies of these outside of the standard sources that we've already got in this video. So we're going to go through and we're going to look at some other stuff. But that's a nice breakdown out of 15 cases. Big, big yikes for these numbers. All right, guys. All right, so you all want pre-sales, right? Some of the best deals available. Well, Tier Zero is sold out of a lot of stuff. Um, there are two other places we're going to cover in this video, though, um, so you guys can get, try to get the best deals really available to you out there. So they had the Almatarions at 25 a piece. They're sold out. Same thing with the Dragon Maid from the kitchen. The Nurse sold out at 15 and those are the big three, but they still have the generator field stage. Uh, they're out of Mardell, they're out of Laplacen, and they're out of the House Dragon Man. So here's what I'm going to say about this. Um, these should come back in stock um, over the next day or so. If you're interested in getting copies from Tuesday, you're always in a What's Good 5. Pay attention to this. You know, just don't open up the video and be like, oh, they're sold out immediately. Do pay attention to them. Get the best deals while they're available. Lapore coming in at five. A lot of these secret airs, three to four dollars a piece for you know the Dragon Maids. I did talk about in my video. I was like, you guys know the stuff's gonna be short print. You're gonna be really paying the price just to be able to play these you know tier three, tier four decks, and it's quite unfortunate. Um, outside of that, a lot more of the Math Mech stuff coming in. A little bit cheaper. Uh, they have the dragons at literally 50 cents a piece. For those of you that have been wanting to pick up Fire Fist stuff, this isn't bad. Especially if you're planning on making another order uh, for other stuff. Uh, the generator boss field spell. St the generate stuff itself is going to be massively cheap. I don't see any reason for this stuff to even just be ridiculous. More of the common stable stuff like Waking the Dragons, 31 cents. Heavy Slups, 31 cents appropriates 31 cents that seems a little bit worth sign it back door lol 31 cents dragon ravines and the rekindlings looking pretty cheap a lot of the even hey you guys remember when people were paying a lot of money on super rejuice 31 cents a piece by the way here so i don't know it seems like it might be worth now we're gonna jump over here to ideal 808 um ideal does still have pretty much everything in stock for this but let's do the basic math for this so if i want to play what's going to be probably the better version i have 75 dollars in kitchen dragon maids right off the bat and nurses are 20 a piece at the moment that's 135 dollars just in that and then considering lapar's down here if i want to you know depending on the engine i want to play you might not have to pick these up. It really just depends. Um, same thing with this guy. So Almatarion being more than $25, I don't think that this is going to hold. And a lot of people that are trying to set the bar for this that are like, oh yeah, like this card's going to be so much more. I disagree 100% with this. This card has no business. And you guys see later in the week and next week when this starts going down, you're going to see that this is going to be ridiculously cheap. So by ridiculously cheap, I think it's going to hold at the $25 mark. So just a fair heads up here that this is what we're dealing with at the moment for this. 
So don't be bamboozled into spending, you know, a large amount of money on this if you're going to need it. I know it bars you guys from wanting to play Math Mech at this point, but don't fall for it. This is not worth it. Paying more than 25 for this is a no-go. 25 is all right. That's where I, I draw the line. I was talking about from a competitive standpoint in the OCG, being able to search for any one good, you know, support card in your deck can really change the tide of a game, but... Whew. Now the generator boss stage at 13 bucks. I think that this is expensive. I like I said, I'm I'm at the point where I'm looking at these and I'm like, alright, so $39 for a set of these. Maybe not so much this. Um we're gonna have a math mech deck profile later today. When you guys get the chance to sit down and look at some of these prices, start looking at your ratios and things, you can adjust from there. But you're you're going to be solidly paying about a hundred to two hundred on Dragon Maids, and Mathmex should be paying about a hundred hundred and fifty on. Like and Generates will probably be about a hundred. Uh, obviously, they should be less, but that just let that sink in. And then you've got Dragons at dollars. Okay, you saw Tier Zero had them a little bit less. Same thing here with Tempest. I see that they have Dark World Dealings at 50 cents a piece. That's not bad, actually. Like, we'll take that. Now, with that being said, we jump on over here. Still a lot of 50 cent cards. 25 cents on Dragon Ravines. For the people who have been holding back on wanting hollow Dragon Ravines, now's a good opportunity. I, I support this. It's so cheap. A lot of this support stuff here, very cheap. Like... Not bad. VFD Super Airs, literally 10 cents. Debris Dragon Super Airs. Like, see, a lot of this cheaper stuff, you can get a rekindling place up for 20 cents plus shipping. Like, that's not bad, actually, at all. All right, now, over here to the hard damage on TCG Player. Um, this These are ridiculous. So we're at 28 on Kitchen Dragon Maid. All Matarions are $75. What is this garbage? Do not, I repeat, do not pay this. This is too much. Watch out. Wait until Monday, Tuesday rolls around. Wait and see if circulation happens. Let these cards go into effect. Black Friday is right around the corner. Pay attention to these things i can't stress it enough this is this isn't going to stick um generator boss stages they're 13 dollars over on ideal 8 dragon mates all right well considering the fact that like these are cheaper over on i'm seeing a lot of cheaper stuff over yonder pay attention to these things house dragon mates no thank you like pre-sales are hot garbage on mystic fighters over here like, you're telling me Ideal 808 is going to be the best place at the moment until Tier 0 restocks for these things. So, here's what I got for you guys. These pre-sales, oh, go over to Ideal, go over to Tier 0. Check, enter what's good 5 on Tier 0. Save money on your purchase. Alright, now I'm going to do a couple of stray things to this video because there are a couple other things I wanted to talk about. Advent Calendar. One of the biggest failures of the year. Just kidding. This actually turned out not to be such a big failure. So, depending on what you pick them up for, if you paid 20s, you lost money. If you paid what they are paying for from distributor, you didn't do too bad, because the one-for-ones are seven fifty a piece. Like, th this is good. Like, this and the, the Performa Karibal. Okay, so, like, this is 4 bucks, And then you get down here to the Link Karibal. This is 2 And then the Kirby RN, these, these are 2 bucks. Winged level ten dollars, spheres dollars. If you want a proxy for speed duel, you can. These are dollars, and then literally, I'm surprised these actually had value in them. Like who knew? Actual Karibo cards are worth something. And I just wanted to walk back through here and once again point out the IP situation. Um, these continuing to go down. We're at five eighty nine at the moment. All right. Pyro Phoenix is 88 bucks. Like, I can't stress the importance of staying up to date on the market because an uneducated buy just means that you wasted a lot of money. 
and Mystic Fighters being, you know, it for the year, really, for us, it, it's going to show that there's a lot of disparity in the community, and it's, it's kind of ridiculous. Outside of that, Dual Dev... Dual Dev settled very well. Super Poly's trickling on up, though, to probably be the most expensive card in the set next to Ash Blossom. And I did predict that, like, these would be the two best cards in it. The Ghost Sisters, on the other hand, seeing Ogres are still holding two bucks uh, kind of surprises me. Seeing how low some of this stuff is getting, but it's just going to take one or two pushes in this set for stuff to literally skyrocket. So let this be a note. Card prices, at least for Mystic Fighters, a little bit rough right now for those that want to pick things up. I get it. it it's not a good place. I I feel you guys. I really do because I wanted to you know have the Dragon Maid deck and mess around with it, but not at these prices. So what do you guys think? Woohoo! Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think about today's market. Well, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace out. The ride never well truly ends. Thank you, patrons. Without you guys, I don't know what I'd be wearing in these videos. I might be a triple shuffle and all over again. Guys, please also check out Vancol40 for some awesome Vanguard content. Some other interesting stuff you might find up here on the left or in the description as well. Thanks for watching.